Don't miss any of the action at Oceanside, Chula Vista, Torrey Pines, and many more San Diego schools. Download the free UT Preps app on Google Play or the Apple App Store. Hey there, sports fans. Christian Pedersen here in the San Diego Prep Insider Studios. Thank you very much for checking in with us. Got a bunch of highlights to get to, so without further ado, enough of my ugly mug. Let's roll the tape. Our first stop of the night out of the pitch at Saints. St. Augustine in the white taking on La Jolla in the black. All you need to know is Luke Hazel got the score and started. What a one-timer. Finds the back of the net. Puts him on the board 1-0. They would go in 2-0 to half. 3-1 later in the game when Saints defense decides to hold steady. Great goalkeeping play. Keeping La Jolla out of it despite La Jolla playing as about as physical as you can get without getting red cards dealt out. Maybe some whistles getting swallowed as Saints moves to 6-5 and five on the season. Here's Hazel. No, we had a good first half, got two goals in, which was nice. Um, we needed that. Um, and then we kind of got restless in the second half, but uh, we played hard what we needed to do. Um, and we got a good third goal. Up now to Santa Fe Christian as they host Country Day. A little women's basketball. Going to get this one started with the definition of a fadeaway shot. California Cooper loses her footing, still finds the bucket. Had a girl. Moments later, Shannon San Million. Gentle touch. But then it was all country day the rest of the night. Jada Villarreal, that's a bucket. Hot soup for her. Bianca Notarini stepping around with a little bit of the sky hook there. Mylani Henson, she was leading the charge all night. Power inside move there. Here she's going to do the full court assist to Kira Oakry. As La Jolla Country Day runs away with this one, let's hear from Henson after the game. Um, it took a team effort. Um, I'm really proud of us, what we did today. We were fighting each other in the fast break. Um, running our sets really clean. Uh, our shooter, Jada, was really on point today, so we're really proud of her for that. We just played together and um, we played as a team, so we're really proud of us. Over to the men now. Country Day looking to bounce back from two straight losses. SFC looking to pick up a big Coastal League win. Big man and I was Brett Johnson. Draining threes like it's going out of style. Owen Askeries was right there helping him. Buckets for the kid. One more from Johnson as he was all sorts of hot soup tonight. There's some minestrone for the kid. Ah! Matt Bender though is about as can't miss for country day as can be. Filling in as the big man tonight. Bender was all over it. Getting buckets on buckets. Little outside, little inside, why not? One more from the outside was Alex Cho, top of the key, splash! Getting the crowd electrified there. Second half now, Max Gwynn helping out a little bit. How about a late dagger from Ryan Langborg? Oh man! Country Day bouncing back with a close victory. Let's hear from Bender after the game. You know, it's been tough having back-to-back -to -back losses. Our leader, Bruce, is out. And you know, we just have to learn to play together and get looks, get good looks. That's about it on our offense, getting the flow.